The Democratic National Convention is happening this week, and as a sign of allegiance and a way for people to indulge in the sacraments of the leftist religion, they decided to be very generous with their resources. And what did they decide to do? Um, give people opportunities to sign up for programs, give people opportunities to uh, have some of their debt canceled as they promised people for student loan debt, give people opportunities to figure out how to get into a first-time housing program, give people opportunities to get free health care. No, well, kind of health care. Depends on how you define health care. The DNC decided to offer reproductive services outside of their DNC convention. Okay, so basically there's a Planned Parenthood mobile health clinic Ugh. set up that's giving out free baby deletions and vasectomies. Okay, this initiative has sparked significant discussion and criticism with some labeling the DNC as promoting the Death National Committee, which is amazing, by the way. Uh, reflecting concerns over the implications of such services at a political event, critics argue that this move starkly represents the Democratic Party's stance on reproductive rights, leading to debates about the ethics and political messaging behind offering these procedures at a national convention. Okay, now, 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 I have a, I have a, I have a contrarian take here. Uh-oh. I think it's a contrarian take. If it's contrarian to the Christian view, it's going to be a really bad take. <laughs> so, obviously, I'm against all forms of baby deletions under all circumstances. Yeah. Even if they're by libs. Even mm -hmm. if they're by, 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 by the, the far leftists who are like, they've, they've literally view it as a sacrament. Even if that's the case. But this other thing, this other thing they're giving out. Yeah. <laughs> is it really that bad? Vasectomies? Vasectomies for people that are going to attend the DNC? Was that included in here? Vasectomies. Oh, there, there we go. They're, go. they're going to let people castrate themselves? I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. So they can't reproduce. Yeah, that's kind of a dumb. Who do you think is going to have all the babies in 20 or 30 great. years? That's great. Gen Z's looking up. This is, <laughs> a, this is a huge victory. That's phenomenal. A bunch of those beta, they're, beta they're, males just getting their... They're yeeting their own population. Yeah. It is reversible, though. Yeah, ain't no one getting that reverse, bro. Yeah. You don't You're, think so? No. No. Which, Once by you the way, do this the deed, is, it's over. This is a thing by... Okay, so there's this dude I used to follow, and I don't anymore. But there is this thing of, like, soy boy leftist guys uh, getting vasectomies to stand in solidarity with... Yuck. Uh, in a post row world. That's not it. I, I'm all about it. I, I'm all about it, dog. I'm all about they it. All right. Do, do, do it. Do Please. It. Yeah. Support, Please. Support you know the the they, need, time, they need you. You know the only time I'm not about it? Hit me. I'm not about it in the sense that a lot of these people are going to grow up. Exactly. And they're going to be like, ah. They might I, have to get the reverse. I went through my phase as a child mm -hmm. and now. I don't, I'm not on that anymore, right? Yeah. It's the whole, like, if you're not a liberal before the age of 35, you have no heart. If you're yeah. a liberal after the age of 35, you have no brain, right? That's a true. lot of these folks are going to flip-flop on this. And so from one standpoint, I'm not that mad at free vasectomies. Like, do it, man. Snip, snip. Hey, and the Catholics are showing up. Sacking Ho Jose. Sorry, I butchered that. I know I did. It's time to take this mobile confessional to the DNC convention in, Ch in Chicago as Planned Parenthood is bringing their mobile abortion to the event. So this man got a got a got his whole confessional built out in a spiritual care unit. So what is this? Hold on. What are they doing? They're trying to prevent this? They're doing, they're doing confessionals. Oh, that's kind of fire. Mobile confessionals. Okay. Now, I don't know if they're actually bringing it to the DNC, but this is a, a proposed plan of action, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess a more one-for-one -one plan of action would be uh, bringing those ultrasound units. Mm -hmm. The 4D ultrasound yep. units, yeah. Yep. yeah this say, is also a good solution. Yeah, they say ultrasound units is probably the best way to mitigate the deletion of babies because if people actually see what's inside of them as a... Because a lot of people just don't know. Yeah. That's the, that's the, dark, that's the actual darkness of the culture of reproductive rights as most people just don't know what's in them and what it looks like yeah so they think they're like snuffing something out that's like a, a little a little worm yeah, yeah, yeah it's yeah. like nah dog that thing got 10 fingers 10 toes yeah we you know we got the ultrasound for our second baby at like i think six weeks mm -hmm. maybe it was eight weeks mm -hmm. and it's probably like six weeks mm -hmm. a little small gummy bear a little heartbeat super sweet right mm -hmm. little gummy bear you know what i mean like big head mm -hmm. whatever mm -hmm. i kind of forgot you know, because I actually got one runner, I got like one running around present with us right now, mm -hmm. and the other one's just growing. Mm -hmm. 
I forgot like how much they develop so quickly. Oh yeah. So we had that fall the next appointment, and maybe mm-hmm. that was the eight weeks, or maybe that was the ten or twelve weeks or something. Mm-hmm. Spine. Oh yeah. Curled up. Mm-hmm. Arms. Yeah, twelve weeks. That's like a that's a, that's that's a that's a human in there. Oh yeah. That's okay. a person. It's always a person. It's always a person, but yep. like that, like that, right? That's like an indistinct. It's not just like a gummy bear. Like, oh, yeah. hi, little gummy bear. Yeah, this yeah. is so cute. You're I, so small. I, this I, is like a whoa. Yeah, like, yeah. I feel like I could hold. I could hold you, and you kind of. I could yeah. like pick you up, obviously. But I think like, it's hey. seven weeks. You got ten fingers, ten toes, eyeballs. Yeah. Whoa. A seven, a six or seven weeks. Yeah. 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 I, I don't. I don't doubt it. It's very. Uh, what well, else we got in here? It was crazy. Uh, if you scroll down a bit, we've got. Uh, <laughs> The DNC Justin, will be for lobotomies and <laughs> all attendees. The DNC will be offering free lobotomies to all attendees. So listen, I think this is good. I'm no, against the, the, the deletion of babies. Okay, good. But I think this is good. One, it prevents them from reproducing. Two, prevents a- it, it, which which then prevents future deletions of babies. Awesome. Two, it 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 lets the DNC put exactly what their what what their cards on the table and tell you exactly what they're about. Exactly. We're celebrating this. Mm-hmm. We're not celebrating life. We're celebrating death. Dia de los muertos. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I think it's... I actually don't know what it means either. <laughs> you don't know what it means. Okay. I so think I think this is a massive W. I think this is great. I think they should lean into it. Go all in, baby. Yeah. No, I think that's awesome. As many as many castrated males as possible. As many castrated soy boys as possible. Yeah. No, uh, at the DNC. At the DNC. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you pull up to DNC, we're being facetious, guys. If you yeah. got a friend that's a DNC or we're not, no, they should go. They should go. They should go. Get 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 upset me right about it. Yeah, it's like a tattoo. It's like a uh, it's like a vacation tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you travel somewhere. You're like, oh, let's get let's get matching tattoos with the bu- with the bros. Yeah. This Which, is by like- the way, I'm not against vasectomies. For people who have kids, vasectomies are probably the best option. Yeah. for birth control. And, unless you're unless you're like Catholic, I think Catholics are against vasectomies oh. all the time. Yeah, but I'm not oh. against vasectomies for people who have kids. I just think it's hilarious for people who don't have kids. This yeah. is the Rolo Tomasi. This is the horseshoe thing, right? So what is the horseshoe? The horseshoe is you got folks on the far right with the red pill that yeah. are like the best way to be a high value man is a vasectomy, and you got folks on the far left. Uh, the best way to support reproductive women's rights is to get a vasectomy. Yeah. I'm like, oh yeah, like this it's is a, you, it's a mass made in heaven. Way. Yeah, yeah, it's the Spider Man meme, you know. So anyway, we see according to the Bible that prayer is extremely important in terms of us being transformed from the inside out when we get aligned with God's will. For the Christians watching this channel, I want you guys to implement these spiritual disciplines in your day to day life. And the only way I've been able to do this consistently is through writing down my prayers in a prayer journal that does a few things. One, it allows me to reflect and come to God humbly and ask him to move on my behalf. And two, it allows me to document my prayers, which ultimately help me remember the very things that I was praying for and see the hand of God tangibly in my life when he answers them. So I would urge you, consider writing down your prayers. It could be in a blank notebook. It could even be on your phone. Or you could check out the one I personally designed and used from my own quiet time and spiritual discipline that I think would be a huge blessing. It's the exact structure and system that I've used for years to pray and be more consistent in my spiritual disciplines. You can pick yours up today by clicking the link in the pinned comment below. All right, I'll see you over there. Peace.